Well, kind of an up and down day. We had some sunshine. We had some fog. We've had some downpours. Our KDK weather watchers reporting a variety of conditions today, most topping out close to, if not just above 80 degrees. 77 degrees currently at Antonio Leo's house in North Huntington under cloudy skies. Relative humidity, 69% there. So thanks for that report, Antonio. Other folks reporting in, Fred Sandusky in Connellsville, still a very warm 81, 75 in Jamestown at Mike Schuerk's house. Clareton, Kathleen Lopresti reporting 78, 80 in Everett where Ken Eicher is, and John Mahalchik in Heidelberg reporting 79 degrees. 82 was the high officially for Pittsburgh today, and the current temperatures still lingering up there, 79 in Waynesburg right now, but we're all the way down to 72 in Somerset, 73 in Champion. Also in Butler and Catanning, 73 degrees. Washington, Wheeling, you're still a little warmer at this hour at 77, as well as Denora with a very sultry 78 degrees. High humidity, lots of moisture in the atmosphere, but for now, the radar not showing much of it reaching the surface. Area of showers and even a couple of thunderstorms move through. First round was last night really late in the evening and then a couple of showers this morning and then just mid to late afternoon we had these showers that eventually bubbled up into a couple of stronger thunderstorms over western Maryland you see right there along I-68. So round one is done, but off to the west, there's another piece of energy that's going to bring us more rain overnight. That's why the National Weather Service has issued a flash flood watch for these counties until tomorrow morning at 11. Allegheny, Washington, Westmoreland, Fayette, also a few counties just over the border into West Virginia. Here's the reason why. Talked about this piece of energy. Fairly strong line of thunderstorms. These have prompted some severe warnings, but are now starting to weaken a bit just through northwest and now north south central Ohio that will continue to move to the east. They'll lose a little bit of power once we get the sun going down, but there's a stationary frontal boundary draped just across the Mason Dixon line. That's giving us enough instability with warm air pushing and that piece of low uh, pressure energy pushing in all of those ingredients. Uh, we're going to have a couple of more rounds of thunderstorms tonight. So we get through the evening on future cast pretty much rain free. So that's great for the concert at Pride Fest for the Three Rivers Arts Fest, anything you're doing tonight. But later tonight and overnight, look what develops by tomorrow morning, especially up along I-80 all the way down just almost to the downtown Pittsburgh. We're looking at a round of pretty heavy showers and thunderstorms in the morning to early afternoon tomorrow. That energy shifts and looks like the concentration for thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon will be along and south of I-70. That's why we have this flash flood watch in effect. But then by Monday morning, a few early morning showers the rest of the day should be pretty much rain free, but still partly to mostly cloudy. So tonight, showers and thunderstorms linger. 64, your overnight low. Most of the activity will be after midnight. Tomorrow, scattered showers, a touch cooler. Normal high is 77, we'll be at 76. Monday, 77, a few morning showers. Then just a chance of a pop-up thunderstorm Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, lots of sunshine, 82. Friday, Saturday, 79. Chance of a thunderstorm Friday, but Saturday so far looks nice and sunny. Paul?